Hi there, it's Jessica with another pro tip from NextGen Personal Finance. So today I want to talk to you about exit tickets. So what I've done is I've navigated to our curriculum tab, I've chosen units, I've chosen managing credit, and then I've navigated to one of my favorite lessons in the semester course, Intro to Credit Scores. When I click here to view it in Google Doc form, what I'll get is the lesson guide. And you'll see down at the very last row, row seven here, um, that we close all of our lesson plans with an exit ticket. And basically there are three different ways that you can distribute that exit ticket to your students to have um, an assessment of what they've learned that day. So the first option is to go ahead and click here on the lesson guide, pop open the resource, and it displays as a slide. You can project this at the front of your classroom, have your students write their answers on a sheet of loose leaf or in their binders or whatever you have them keep for the class. Um, you could do a discussion out loud, or you could have them pair share, whatever you want to use the slide for. Um, you can just project it and use it that way. The second option you will see also in the lesson guide is that you can do this as a Google form. So if you click here, you'll be immediately prompted to make your own copy of the Google form. Click here. You would want to go ahead and rename yours, whatever you want to call it. And what your students would see is that exact same set of questions that was previously on the slide is now in a Google form that can be graded as a quiz. So they would fill in their identifying information. There's the exact same two questions. When they complete it, they would push submit. And if you're familiar with the way Google form quizzes work, you will then receive all of your students' answers in the class into one big spreadsheet that you can grade from there. Um, so that's your second option. And then the third option is if you are teaching our full lessons, you may or may not want to give your students the student activity packet. If you click here, it'll open up the SAP and it's the exact same resources that are in the lesson guide, but now they're in a format where students have time or room, I'm sorry, to write their answers on the document. So if you scroll down to, to box seven, again, you'll see those exact same questions. And here you could either print this out and have your students um, answer with pen or pencil, or you can have them do it digitally and answer it electronically here. But either way, the exit tickets are always going to be the exact same set of questions for a given lesson, just three different ways you can distribute it. I hope that helps.